You're wanting to get into the property game, but you're not too sure which strategy to do. Well, this is what I'm going to show you today. Which property strategy should you do based on the savings amount you have in your bank account? So let's get into it. If you go between zero and one thousand pound, I advise doing co-sourcing. This is basically where you're selling a deal. Uh, to an investor but you do it via another compliant deal sources company they might take a bit of a fee but you'll at least end up with 1.5k in the bank for every deal that you sell and it's a great way to build up cash flow with putting zero money down okay the next thing is if you've got cash plans of 1 to 10k i would advise you deal sourcing or aka as known as deal packaging where you're simply selling a deal to an investor for 3k fee you sell like free deals for example you've already got 9k in savings and you can move on to the next strategy okay if you've got a cash balance of 10k to 50k, I'd advise rent and HMO and rent rent SA, where you're basically renting a product from a landlord, then renting out again either on Airbnb.com if you're doing SA or spareroom.co.uk if you're doing HMO. Okay, it's a br brilliant way to build up a 5 to 10k a month cash flow within three to six months. If you've got a cash balance of 50k to 100k, I'd also advise still doing rent rent, but you can also incorporate small flips, joint venture purchases, as well as assisted sales into your toolkit of property strategies. So rent rent is still being the best option, but also you can do buy, refurb, and sell the houses, or buy a house of a friend, or refurb a seller's property to help them sell it for a higher price and keep the difference. That's known as an assisted sale. Okay. If you've got a cash balance of 100k plus, I would, I would do personally, you can do BR single lets, you can do BR to HMO conversions, you can raise finance, you can do small developments, you can do title splitting, where you turn, turn a house into multiple apartments, you can do commercial or residential conversions, etc. You should easily be able to build a portfolio of minimum 3k per month cash flow within six months, maybe up to one year. Okay, it just depends how fast you move. Now keep in mind, even at six figures, a lot of people still do rent rent because no other strategy can give you a, cons a consistent uh, five to 10K per month cash flow within three to six months. Only rent rent can do this. I hope this helps.